Can you explain to us the business strategies used uh, in the automobile automobile industry? Yeah. I mean, it, it's a very capex intensive uh, business. Uh, I'm not I'm not a big fan, not a big fan um, of the industry. Um, I, I don't believe in investing or starting any companies where you have a big inventory risk because inventory can destroy a uh, business pretty easily, actually. Um, so uh, in general, um, they, they focus a lot on advertising. Um, and usually it's every 10 or 15 commercials you see of a certain car that might influence you to buy it. So there, there's so many overhead expenses. It is just, it's, the, it's a really bad business. Not as bad as the airline industry. Uh, but it's usually a pretty, pretty tough industry to, to invest in. I've invested in the automotive sector all over the world. Uh, probably one of the last ones I bought was Hyundai uh, in, in South Korea uh, because it traded below a price to book of one time about 15 years ago or so. But, but I usually avoid that sector because of inventory concerns um, and very, very capex uh, intensive. Yeah, it's hard, man. Like I just watched actually uh, on television, I rented... A, a documentary that Alec Baldwin was in uh, on the DeLorean car. Uh, and John DeLorean, founder of that company, he was a rock star at GM with the Pontiac brand, etc. He was amazing. And it was so hard for him to start his own company. And he did some unethical things as well. I won't ruin the, the movie for you. You can check it out. But it's tough. It is really, really hard to make it big in, in that sector. If you want inspiration, uh, what I would do is watch the movie Tucker, uh, which is with Jeff Bridges. It's a true story about a man who tried to take on the big three automakers. Uh, and he has a very positive attitude, but they muscled him out of the business. Yeah, it's a tough gig, tough industry.